and welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. We're bringing you guys all the tech all the time. Now, most people know that a new line of cards from AMD has launched and there's been a lot of questions surrounding these cards of how they'll work in Crossfire with other gen cards. So the main test that we're gonna be showing you guys today is the new R9 280X used in Crossfire with a 7970 gigahertz edition video card. Now we did run into a few little snafus here and there, but we did get it for the most part to work without any problem with a few variances here and there, which we'll get into and talk to in just a second. Right here, I've got the the test station back here behind me. It's based on Haswell. It's got 32 gigabytes of Patriot Viper Memory Extreme. It's got the 4770K. Got an Evo 612 cooler on there. All in all, a pretty solid test station. We got the Hero motherboard from ASUS back there. That's a really good solid board for doing testing on. And with that said, let's actually jump in and talk about some of the problems and some of the things that we discovered by trying to get these two cards to run in Crossfire. Now, first of all, one of the things that we noticed is that you cannot have the R9 280X is the primary card. You have to have the 7970 gigahertz card as the primary card in order to get this Crossfire configuration to work. Now, as you can see in different applications, we got different results showing which card is which. In GPU ID and in the unit engine, they showed separate cards. They showed the R9 280X as a separate card and they showed the 7970 as a separate card. But when we ran the latest 3D mark, it showed both those cards as 7900 series cards. So some of the software out there is taking a while to catch up. Like I said, when we originally got the cards, the cards strictly showed as 7970s. After a BIOS update and a driver update, then the cards showed to be R9 280X cards. So maybe the same things happen out there with some of this test software. Maybe in the future when these guys do an update, they'll show all the cards as being you know what they are. But for now, you guys can see the results are very but you can successfully crossfire a 7970 gigahertz card and an R9 280X. So I hope you guys really like this video. If so, hit that like button down there and show us that you like it. All the information will be down there in the description button as well. If you're not following us, hey, hit the sub button back here behind me. And I'm Elk. We'll see you guys back here on Tech of Tomorrow for more tech. Now tomorrow, for those folks interested, we will have the Crossfire results of the new R9 280X. But for those people who stuck around and watched the video, down the link in the description below, we'll have a link to that right now. So if you're an early bird and you want to check that out, go and check out the link in the description below. You guys can also click right here if you want to. I'm Elric, and we'll see you guys back here on Tech of Tomorrow.